Hello everybody, welcome to your channel Eco Engineering. This is your host Chia Lelipur. In this video, I'm going to teach you a strategy based on slippage. This strategy works whenever the price goes high or down intensively. It is specifically designed for algorithmic trading. And in the first part, I'll teach you how the strategy works. And in the second part, uh, I'll show you how I programmed it. And then at the last, at the last part, we backtest this strategy and see its performance. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video and stay with me to the end. And at the end of the video, if you liked it, please hit the like button. So YouTube algorithm will introduce us to those who are interested in this video. And please do not forget to subscribe to our channel. Stay with me to the end. So in this chart, we have several candles. They are in the same area. Uh, I know when the price changed between, for example, ten dollar to fifty dollar, it's a lot. But here, it's just an example. I want to, I want to just show you how this strategy works. These candles are in the same uh, area and they are uh, fluctuating very smoothly. For example, the last candle, this for this tick of price, it's around forty dollar, and for the next one, it's around thirty, and then it goes to twenty five. And then it goes to around 35. It just smoothly fluctuates around 30. But uh, at this point, for example, we have several sell orders in the upper sides of this price, which is here. And they are whether sell stops or sell limit. It doesn't matter. But the sum of them is around uh, are around. 20 lots and uh, we have around 20 lots sell orders but suddenly a big player with 100 lot buy order come into and because there is not enough sell order to fulfill this buy order suddenly price jump to the higher prices and something like that happened and it goes around 100 in this case the price never seen 80 or 70 because uh, this buy order was very high and very powerful that it slipped all orders upper side and then for example it continues it's called slippage in this case the price intensively increase and it doesn't see some values it can happen for red candles too and this is the meaning of the slippage but how does this strategy work this strategy, this algorithm, check the tick of price. For example, in this case here, if you remember, this or any of them are a price tick. It check each price tick with the previous price, and whenever it jumps by around, for example, three uh, three hundred points or thirty pips, it consider it as a big player came into the market, and when this big player buy. We try to buy with him, and when these big players sell, we try to sell with him. And this is the basic of the strategy. So whenever the tick, whenever the price suddenly jump, and it may happen once per two days, per three days, so it's very, and it happened in the seconds, so it's very hard to predict it. It's very hard to do it manually. That's why this strategy specifically is designed for algorithmic trading. And whenever it happened, we go with it. When whenever the price whenever a big player buy this uh for example pair we buy with him and whenever he, it sell we sell with it it's very important in the next chapter i show you how i programmed it briefly show you and then in the last chapter we back to this strategy together uh, okay, in this section, I'll show you how I programmed it. I just briefly show you because I have a full course for learning how to program an algorithmic trading with MQL, and I leave you the link, the, uh, the link here. But here we briefly just discuss about uh, code. For this purpose, I go to MetaCode Language Editor. I press this button or press F. Four on my keyboard, uh, so we can check this slippage in two different ways. The first way is just uh, just compare the, the price right now with the previous price and if it jumped for example by 30 pip points or uh, 3 pips based on the currency or uh, stocks that we are working with 
at this point I'm working with Euro UST because it's my favorite pair. And based on my experience, I think if I put if I adjust it in on 30 points, it will uh, answer better. But as I said, there is two ways. First, we can check the current price with the previous price with the previous tick price, or but in this case. I'm using I open, I close to minus the open of the previous candle in one minute time frame minus the close of previous candle in the one minute time frame. And for example, in this case, if this is the current candle in the one minute time frame, if I go to one minute time frame, this is the current candle, this is the second candle, the previous candle. I compare the open and close together, and if the difference between them is higher than 30 points. I open a new order and I do it only once per each candle in one hour time frame. In one hour, we are not allowed to open more than one order. It's very important for me. And here I restricted I restricted the code to only send order when we the time that the hour of the day is between 12 and 20. Based on experience, I think this in this time, the volatility of the market is high and I can gain uh, much more profit from this strategy and it is much more efficient. That's why it's just based on experience. You Maybe your experience and your time zone is different and you can use different time. But, but for me and for the place that I am living in, this this interval is the most efficient for me. It's written like that. And now we go to MetaTrader to backtest this strategy. To backtest this strategy, I uh, open the strategy tester here. In the strategy tester, uh, I choose the strategy that I am using. The name is slippage strategy for your UST because the values are, the uh, set points are adjusted for your UST. And I want to test it from the 1st of uh, September to the 20 of, 20th of December. And I want to have it for a one hour time frame. And if I press expert properties, I want it to start with 100,000 euro USD and it is allowed to open both long and short positions. And if I press OK, and uh, there is another input that I have adjusted there and it is the risk person. I wanted to risk my uh, I want it to open orders, any orders which is opened by this strategy, if it hit its stop loss, it only risks 1% of my balance. It's very important. I never risk more than 1% of my balance. So I press OK and I start the strategy. I want to have a clean uh, template here. So this is the strategy and let's just okay it's working like that uh, and uh, it's very important to notice that here the risk to reward is six when i open an order the uh, based on some calculation i set some uh, uh, stop loss and because the risk to reward is six then the take profit will be six times higher than the uh, distance between the entry and the stop loss I fast forward the video and when it is uh, that the backtest is finished, we I come back and we check its performance. Okay, the back test is finished. Let's see the result. This is all the results of the uh, the open orders. For example, here, if we lose 1% of our uh, 
uh, balance, which because uh, we invest around 100,000 USD, here when we hit the stop loss, we lose about $1,000. But when we, because the risk to reward is six, we gain around $6,000. And uh, this is the whole. Uh, this is, and this is here is the graph. Is the graph of see? It's like a trend. We gain money like a trend. It's very really important. Here we lose or we are in a, some range. We don't gain a lot of money, but again we start gaining it, and and this is the graph of gaining money. And when we go to the report, so we started with one hundred thousand dollar, and we the total net profit is one hundred around one hundred twenty three twenty four thousand dollar. It means one hundred twenty three percent profit. It's amazing. Uh, and remember, we didn't risk a lot of money for every order that we open we only risk one percent of our balance it's very important and we open 342 uh, order trade 342 trade and uh, here we can see the maximum drawback uh, short position one and uh, profit trades long position one and the last trade we have all of them here it's very important to know, remember that this strategy is only designed for algorithmic trading because, as I mentioned, this uh, this jumps, this slippage happen in a second, and it may happen once per day, once per two day, uh, and for as a human being, it's not possible for us to sit down in front of the monitor the whole time. And when it happened, we open an order. We we definitely lose them. That's why I suggest you to learn how to program and algorithmic trading but it's very important to notice here uh, another uh, it's important it, it's important where we start our practice we start our practice from the 1st of September but if we start our practice from here uh, then for the beginning we would have lost some money but again we would gain it but then our profit would not be 123 percent it's very important uh, but generally speaking this strategy is profitable and it is very good and i use it a lot but it's still i don't wish you should you should notice that the back test is highly depends on from the day that you start to back test it so i hope you enjoyed this video please if you enjoyed it and if you think that it is useful for you hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button. So whenever we upload new video, you will receive a notification. And in this case, you will never lose a video. I wish you a good day. Goodbye.